Hey gang, I am in Belvedere, Illinois right now at a cemetery called Belvedere Cemetery. And I want to give a shout out to Jody Dickman and Rose Warringer who really gave me the lead on this. There are two young women, girls that are buried here that met with a very tragic accident in the cold winter months and they were involved in a car accident. So let's go pay respects to their graves. It's gonna be a short walk today. And the first thing that I see here is a VFW post 1461. And you can see a lot of, well, we got veterans here, that's for sure. And look at all these wreaths. Isn't this great? Christmas time. And it just gives you a real warm feeling. For Christmas, that warm feeling, but really the warm feeling that our veterans are being remembered. And people really take time out and appreciate the sacrifices of all these great people that have passed and also those that live today. It's a beautiful sight. Well, we're gonna walk this way and we're gonna talk about a really sad story. It was on Friday, February 24th it was about 5.30 p.m. It was a cold, sleety, snowy evening. And two girls, two best friends were together. They were driving, they were heading to the basketball game. It was Brenda Yanitza Gutierrez and Thalia Chanel Ardando. And you, wonderful smiles, a wonderful life. Belvedere is a solid community. It's a great place to grow up. What could go wrong? Well, they're driving to the basketball game. There were cheerleaders there. And unfortunately, with the roads the way they were, they came upon the curve, traveling in their Chevy Cavalier. It was Brenda who was driving and she lost control on this big curve. The car went sliding to the left into oncoming traffic. And sadly, just like that in the snap of a finger, there was a broadside collision with a car coming the opposite way, a Chevy SUV. Hitting the passenger side, no seat belts. And it's, it's really actually hard to imagine that they weren't wearing their seat belts because the cars these days, you know, for, for many years now, it's, they have the annoying beeping and the bell going off. You can't, you can't help but put your seatbelt on. But they did not have their seatbelt on. And that was, that was the end, sadly. It was pretty quick. They were pronounced dead at the scene. The people in the other car survived. They had injuries. It wasn't their fault. But Brenda and Thalia were killed. So sad. And as many of you know, this really hits close home to me. As we lost our daughter. Pretty much the same way. Here is their grave. It is a, an amazing monument that is here of solid granite two hearts come together. Brenda on the left, Ali on the right. It's already decorated for Christmas. 
you know they're getting a lot of visitors. They are remembered. So what can I say? It says we, the perfect two, they're buried here together here in Belvedere. Well, girls, you are together in heaven. And we hope that we hope that you're resting in peace.